Hi, my name is Paul Foss. I'm the president of the Waterboys for Jesus. A few years ago, Larry Goldman approached me at the end of one of our weekly men's meetings and suggested we start a God fund. He said we could throw a few bucks in at the end of each meeting and we could watch it grow. A few weeks later, Larry told us that we had already raised a hundred dollars. And we wondered together what God had in mind for us to use that money for, but we didn't wonder long. Because when I got home from that meeting that day, I opened an email up from a lady whose dad lives in South Africa. And he was wondering if she knew anybody that had a hundred dollars to buy some water pipes so he could run some water to a small village not far from his home. Needless to say, the water boys bought those water pipes that day. The next week we got together and we remembered together in John 4 where Jesus had told the lady at the well that he had living water that if she drank she would never be thirsty again. But more than that, he told her that if she drank that water she would become a wellspring of living water herself to pour out into her community. We've experienced that miracle. Over the last few years, we've actually been able to help put shoes on hundreds of barefooted Hondurans feet. We've bought 15 water coolers for orphanages in India. We've started dozens of micro businesses all over the world. We've even helped a young Hindu girl by paying for her education, training her to learn how to do an occupation, and recently we've even helped pay for her wedding. But once John Wesley said that if you gave him ten men who feared nothing but dishonoring God, hated nothing but sin, and knew nothing at the center of their lives but Jesus Christ and Him crucified, that He would change the world. And you know what? The Water Boys for Jesus has changed the world. But we're more than just about giving our scraps to help change the world. We're also about wanting to change us. Our goal is to take ordinary men and help them become mighty warriors in the Kingdom of God. Each month, we say we're going to give one Saturday a month, two or three hours, to help serve at the margins in our community. Whether that be to help a young woman move furniture to an apartment, whether it mean a home extreme makeover for someone whose houses has gotten away from them, whether it is even hauling old molds of ceramic out of the basement of an elderly lady because she can't do it herself. In whatever way that works out to be, we're going to be the hands and feet of Jesus. And you know what? Transformation happens. Ordinary men are becoming mighty warriors for God. And as they do, their families follow them. And if families are changed, homes of light are created all over the community. And if communities are changed, then the world is changed. So, here's my ask. Why don't you join us? The Water Boys for Jesus are determined to change the world they live in and to become transformed into what Jesus wants them to be.